Western Europe, but ships also come to Preston from many parts of the world. The route for ships into Preston Dock is past Liddell and St. Anne's and along the narrow channel of the River Ribble. As the ships pass, the estuary is full of activity, yachting being a great attraction.
Cars and lorries are driven on and off the ship very easily. For holiday makers, this service enables them to plan a motoring holiday from their own doorstep to anywhere in Great Britain or on the continent. Because these ferry services are available not only as in this case between Preston and Northern Ireland, but also between various other ports in Great Britain and on the continent. The only driving one cannot do on this type of holiday is on and off the ship. Special white-coated pilots do this little job. A lorry using this service is loaded at the factory and the driver, travelling with the lorry on board the ship, delivers the load in person at the buyer's premises anywhere in Europe without disturbing the cargo at all. seen on ships here. Mechanically operated folding hatch covers are fitted instead. When the covers have been folded up, the cargo is usually loaded direct onto waiting lorries. Thank <laughs> you. 
China pay ships from Cornwall are unloaded by grab, which elevates the fine powder to automatic wagons, and these wagons weigh each load before taking it into the warehouse. few surviving havens for small steam engines. The large pile of what looks like sheets of brown paper is a cargo of wood pulp from the continent. It will be processed by the paper mills in and around Preston. This ship from Hungary has brought pit props. Drive right up beside the gangway 
and walk straight onto the ship without any formality.
along the channel, another group of ships will arrive with their passengers and cargo to start the activities of the dock all over again.